Hey, how's it going? That's great to hear. I'm pretty good myself too. Thanks for asking. Today, I'm going to start this off with a simple question. In your opinion, what is the most destructive mob in Minecraft? I mean, there's quite a few to choose from. I mean, creepers are obviously terrible. You know, withers are probably worse because they've got that projectile destruction thingy and you know you do not want an ender dragon in your world because just everything everything will be destroyed but here's the thing there's actually there's actually this other mob that is more destructive than all of them this guy can break pretty much any block and you've probably never heard of him it's just this guy called a zombie so basically i've encountered this weird occurrence where zombies will break pretty much any block that is presented to them. Um, so it's pretty simple to do, all you need is a little zombie over here, a villager to lure him out, and this setup, kind of, it doesn't have to be this, but this works. So basically, all you have to do is you take a door, like so, and you place it like that, and then you will retract a piston like this so he can gain access to said door like so so he will actually start to break it and if we actually push him back he'll continue to break it but if we actually push any block into that door you'll notice that he will continue to break the door but now that the other block is there he will actually break that block in its place kind of weird now like i said this guy can break pretty much anything, including blocks that aren't supposed to be broken, such as bedrock, for example. Nothing, nothing can stop this guy. So let me just show you that. So just to trigger it again, let him out, let him start smashing the door, put him back in his cage, and if I were to actually place bedrock, like so, you'll actually see that it is being broken, and it will, when you get to the end of it, it will break. There you go. Ridiculous, really ridiculous. Now I'm presenting this as a block breaker, but there are actually a few vital flaws that prevent this from being particularly useful. The first one being that this requires the placing of a door and the destruction of a door to trigger the zombies bashing ability. And to my knowledge, there's no way to automatically do that, which is unfortunate. But the next thing is that once the zombies actually broken the block, the block won't drop in item form, which is a pretty big bummer, unfortunately. Um, unless the block is part of a two block block. So for example, if we uh, activate this, like so, and we placed something such as this sunflower, because, you know, we need, we really need sunflowers to be destroyed, you know, that's a very important thing in Minecraft tech. That will actually drop the item, but if it's just a regular block, such as this redstone block, that won't drop, which is, like I said, unfortunate. But the reason I'm showing all of this is because perhaps someone watching this video knows something that could perhaps make this work. This is often how cool things come about in the Minecraft community. Someone does something, someone else sees it, and we go, wait, I know, I know how to make that even better. So that's why I'm showing this, in case somebody knows how to make this better. But I thought it was pretty cool nonetheless. I hope you learned something today. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.